the 1953 AMT Flipnose Ford coming up next. What's in the box? What's in the box? What's in this box? What's in the box? Hello everybody, my name is Trevor Selescu and welcome again to Monster Hobbies What's in the Box? And today we're going to open up this 1953 Ford Flipnose truck and check out the awesome drag stuff. <laughs> so, without further ado, let's go down and open up this thing and see what's in the box. Hot truck, hot truck, coming up. We've got our AMT Ertl 1953 Ford Flip Nose to take a look at. And this thing is pretty cool. I do believe this came out in the 1970s because it's got that huge blower on there and flip noses became popular at that period in time. But it is still a 53 Ford. So, without further ado, here are the instructions for this great kit. And it's again an RC2 kit, so earlier than the round two releases. But here you can see you get this really cool blown Ford 429, I do believe, or Ford 427, but either way. It's got these nice Wyland uh, injected um, cylinder heads, or not cylinder heads, valve covers. Huh. I'm forgetting my automotive jargon. Oh my goodness. There's the frame, which has these nice uh, independent suspension pieces, as well as the bars and everything, so that it can take that massive motor. You get these very cool wire wheels. There's your interior going together. Yeah, it's got the 1970s pleated upholstery. Uh, but look at the pickup bed. You get to put on the fenders separately, and it's got the opening and closing tailgate. And of course, there's the body and everything going on that frame. And they also give you a, a paint color chart. So now let's examine our deck all sheet. And there you go. Pay to play and too low. And that's a little sign for putting on your own little plastic signs for Ford parking only. And these are some very nice white and yellow outlined scallops. Now we're going to look at our chrome. I'm not going to take this out of the bag again, because the bag actually protects our chrome. So we've got these great wire wheels and these great ladder rails, as well as an open-ended uh, Ford front grille, the classic front grille. And now, taking a look at our gray plastic, there's our flip nose hood, as well as our cab. So there's the two together. And it's got this nice detail of these hood pins, quick release hood pins. And this would flip forward this way when you put it together. There's the pickup bed with some really nice wood grain inside and underneath. Very nice, very nice. And here's the radiator and the engine with those nice big carburetors right there. Lots of good detail. Here's the clear glass. And if you want to hang this on the wall, it's got a little hook here. Uh, I don't know what that's for, but clip it off. Okay, there's our interior. And as you can see, it's got those pleated 70s type door panels that cross hatch pattern which was popular then. There's one of the separate fenders for the back. There's our frame. Looking pretty nice. These are the running boards and the floorboard for the pickup truck. There's some of our Ford Monster Motor pieces with the two separate exhaust pipes. You glue them together and it makes up the manifold. It looks like somebody was gluing this engine block together, but huh, you get the idea. There's a left and right hand side. There's a rear suspension with this great rear axle. There's some little bits, including our dashboard. And that's the front of the truck.
Then we have these nice 1970s era bucket seats. There's our firewall, and here's our back uh, tailgate. And notice it doesn't have Ford stamped in here. It's pretty slick. If you're looking for one that has Ford stamped in there, check out the other AMT 50 Ford. There's our steering wheel and a little baggie. And our tires, and this time we don't get any optional tires, we just get the ones in the kit, which are some pretty wide Goodyear's. And that wraps up our look at the AMT Ertl 1953 Ford Flipnose Truck. Well, I hope you enjoyed this episode of Monster Hobbies What's in the Box, where we got to look at the 53 Ford Flipnose Truck. And if you'd like to see some of the other cool cars in our old classic model kit series, please click here, click here, and click down here. And don't forget to like and subscribe to us right here so we can continue to make these amazing videos.